Each week, Wells Fargo Bank brings us stories of athletes who have overcome adversity in their lives to succeed in school and in sports. Marissa, this week we visit a Mountain View family with deep roots in basketball and an incredible family bond. But now the family faces a huge challenge off the court. This is Sammy Poliso playing basketball as our Scholar Athlete of the Year in 2007 for the Pinewood Panthers. She is now the head girls basketball coach at Los Gatos High. Sammy's two younger sisters now play for Mountain View High. Two more basketball stars in an active family where basketball is a way of life. Here watching the Mountain View team play is Nancy Poliso, a mother of five and proud of her basketball playing girls. She used to coach her daughters after playing herself. But now Nancy is in a wheelchair because she is battling ALS, Lou Gehrig's disease. During coaching, the AAU girls, I would play a lot with my seventh graders and I noticed some weakness in my foot and I was a runner and on a rainy day, I actually ended up running on a treadmill and I could hear the delay in the foot. And that's what started the process. It's been a slow progression, thank God for that. But the, the strength of, of my sisters at this age to be able to handle this and to continue to flourish, you know, in the classroom, on the basketball court, with their friends, it's, it's, it's unbelievable. And I can't imagine going through something like that, watching my mom go through what she's going through now in high school. And it's hard because we know, like if you knew my mom before the disease, she was coaching, running around. Like, she's probably the most active person. Bailey Poliso is the sharpshooting leading scorer for the Spartans. Her game is plenty good enough to get her a scholarship, but largely because of mom's ALS, Bailey will play close to home next season, most likely at a junior college. To battle ALS is expensive, and the family is feeling the pinch. The biggest problem for us as ALS patients is we ask a lot of our family and friends to donate to research and I feel strongly some of that money needs to be allocated to the families. It's a huge financial burden. I've been working, my brothers and sisters have been working so we're all trying to pitch in and help out. I mean if I could get something to go to college, like to an actual college, it would be huge. But I would rather have that money to help my mom than to help me go to college. My older siblings who can drive and work and they work and we try to, you know, not eat out and stuff <laughs> so mom can use her breathing machine. But <laughs> The terrible truth is most patients with ALS are gone within five years. The disease attacks your muscles, eventually leaving you paralyzed and ultimately unable to breathe. For Nancy, the progress of the disease is much slower. She was diagnosed four years ago and is doing relatively well. I was lucky enough to qualify for a research study. That seemed to keep me mentally moving forward. Unfortunately, we didn't get positive results. With Nancy, her husband, and five kids, they call themselves the Magnificent Seven. No matter what, Nancy will always be part of the Seven. I mean, she's not, it's not like she's not going to be there. Like, I know even if she's not there, she's still there. And I'm still going to hear her in the back of my head telling me what to do and what not to do. Bailey says basketball helps hold the family together. Nancy comes to the games as she always has. Sammy coaches at Los Gatos, so Nancy also goes to those games. Nancy knows her legacy is with these children. I have watched my kids grow into beautiful people that will continue to be beautiful, compassionate people. So whatever life brings, I get to know I left that behind. Just a really tough situation, Marissa. I've known Nancy for several years since uh, Sammy was playing on the Pinewood team. Just a wonderful woman, but the family is doing, you know, the best that they can. Lots of support from all over from the Mountain View squad. Yep, course. absolutely, and from Sacramento State and everywhere.